All right, we're going to be going over uh, finishing uh, mechanics for the rear naked choke, entering into the rear naked choke, uh, basic, some basic back control uh, and stuff for our fundamentals program. Um, starting out, both hooks in, that means both our feet in between our partners. We're going to look for our hands to lock around in a seatbelt grip from over one shoulder to under the opposite side armpit. Uh, grip configurations differ person to person. I prefer what I like to call a meat hook grip, where I'm taking my choking side arm, planting my thumb in my partner's chest, my opposite side hand is gripping the meat of my own hand uh, on the pinky side. Right? One thing that we want to focus on here, when we get into this choking position or this uh, back control position, is that our partner's head is not above our own. It's very difficult for us to reach through and actually make a, a substantial grip on our partner's shoulder blade uh, from here. So if we're in a seated position, what we're going to do is lock our hands on the center of our partner's chest, draw those hands in tight to our own shoulder, and then scoot our butt back as far as necessary to pull our partner's head uh, onto the level of our own or below. Right? We're going to look to make this an unfair fight in regards to our partner's defense. If they are up here gripping, uh, specifically toward our choking arm most likely, all right, we're going to take our control arm, that's the underside arm, look for a knuckle grip. Uh, knuckle grip, I like making sure that my palm covers my partner's, the back of my partner's hand, and folding their knuckles over like a, like a taco shell. All right, my opposite side hand is going to crawl through behind the back as I use my head to push my partner's head into the choking arm. All right, I'm looking to latch hand uh, as deep onto my partner's shoulder blade as possible and cover it with my own chin. Once we have this control, this choking grip in, ideally elbow in line with our partner's spine, we're going to withdraw the support arm and then slide through locking our arms in place together, choking arm grabbing our shoulder or bicep of the control arm, control arm through behind our partner's head, head to head nice and tight, and we're going to look for two types of finishes. One's going to be uh, minimal effort. This is going to be crawling our hands behind our back, our elbows pinching together, did a big deep breath, and then slowly dropping those elbows into the center of our own chest to find that finish. The second grip that we're going to take, right, once again, scoot back if necessary. We fight for the control side arm, release it to crawl our hand behind our partner's neck, behind their shoulder blade, cover with our own head, release our control, move through to the finishing position of the choke. Second one is going to be more of a, a cutting motion of drawing my right arm, right elbow back, 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 behind my partner's shoulder blade. That's the attempt, at least it's going to be an elicited tap most likely before then, but we're anchoring on our support arm. Uh, so I'm anchoring my right hand on my left bicep, left shoulder, drawing my right elbow back toward my partner's shoulder blade. That's going to be me drawing my shoulder blade back behind my body, drawing my elbow in tight to my side. <laughs> Unlikely that we're going to obviously finish this from a, uh, a, a seated position. So what we do often in the fundamentals is show it here and then move our way into the choking side. So falling toward my right arm, falling toward my right arm. Here, dropping my partner's head into uh, the arm that we we're choking with. Again, control the knuckles, crawl the hand through cover with our head and chin, release control with our top side arm, slide back, right? All we have to do is separate our head far enough to slide the arm through behind, anchor our arms. We either have hands crawling back, elbows dropping into our partner's chest, or we have right hand choking arm, anchoring, elbow drawing back and down toward our side to find that tap. Uh, the difference here is going to be one of uh, most likely discomfort uh, on its way to uh, an actual choke, uh, whereas the first is going to be much more comfortable uh, and put that choke on a little bit slower. Mm -hmm.